man, Woody likes the crooked cock. Keep it out of my Pokemon. Yeah. So what we had was we had uh, not at Sunday school. It was just at school school. It was so sick. It was called Tele Francais. And learning French was not exciting. But mm-hmm. Tele Francais was like, it had like a good opening theme song and everyone knew the words. And it was like a silly, silly fucking like picture of a pineapple. Like it was like, that's that's who spoke to you, Anana, like which means pineapple. And when that show came on, we like actively knew it wasn't a good show, but Tele Francais mm-hmm. was on and the whole fucking class like got lit singing the theme song every time and we would watch like three episodes in a row you'd sing it like three times everyone's like we're looking at each other we're like ah tele 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 and like the teacher was like i'm gonna put it on but you guys can't you can't sing it you cannot you cannot sing it yeah we were like we were like tele hello how how uh how fluent did you ever get with french I could read a book in French. I could mm-hmm. understand people from France speaking French. I could communicate adequately with people. Um, and then I'm from Quebec. I cannot understand Quebecois French or the people here. It's like a, its own thing, and it's oh, they slang and weird. They oh, weren't you teaching you Quebecois French? French. They were teaching no, they you, teach like you French. 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 They teach you language okay. French, like textbook but then French. People here just have their own. It's like imagine you were like you learned English. And then you went to like a really southern part of the USA mm-hmm. where it's like, like too much Howdy twang Parker. on that accent, and you're just like, what the fuck are they saying? Yeah, yeah. it's you like know? West Virginians, like in Appalachian Mountains, where it's like they're speaking English, but they don't know what the fuck they're right. saying. All right, now you're coming for me. Now <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're not one of those here. folks. You, you're very. Oh, uh, I am Eastern articulate. Kentucky. You think West Virginia's bad? My word. <laughs> oh, oh, is it worse? Yeah. Well, it's about the same. I've been to the worst of West Virginia and Eastern Kentucky, and I couldn't tell a difference. It's <laughs> it's pretty close. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad East, East Kentucky's a lot more crime and meth oriented, whereas West Virginia's a lot more inbreeding. <laughs> But it, it bad, all comes all out in the wash of like the exact same. Yeah, you, you just see someone who's got something wrong with him. You're like, ah, that's probably not good. Uh, his dad is probably <laughs> moonshine related. He's got a yeah, grandpa dad. Probably. Well, that grandpa reference dad you made earlier, like that. that reference you you said earlier, it's a going blind drinking moonshine. Was that a Squid Billy's reference by chance? No, no, that was. was a, I've uh, known people who built stills and made it too strong and went blind. It's so a, that's a real thing. The squid billy joke was yes, based off of thing. reality then. Oh, yeah, right. so, so yes, like, yes, uh, yes. I, I think like we, we looked this up on the show a while ago. So basically when you make your own alcohol, you know how like ethanol is, is the, it, that's what alcohol is. Right. So apparently like the reason that when they run a still and they're bottling, they like let it run for a bit is because methanol, which is a different kind of alcohol that makes you go blind is it's like, the first part. is the first stuff to come out. And so the if you just start out. bottling methanol, and you drink that, it can like permanently blind you. Mm-hmm. Which the is why, like, is... just go to the fucking store and buy. It. Yeah, well, I've been so... involved in people making moonshine in prison, and they even them who can sell it for several dollars a drop, even they mm-hmm. pour out that first bit. You know? Yeah, yeah. Better safe than sorry. Mm-hmm. Like nothing's worth your sight. And I'm sorry, Wendigo. You were about to say something. Isaiah? No, no. I was just, I was just gonna say, he's talking about go to the store. The main reason that it is a thing is because. Uh, Around Prohibition, there's a lot of people who died trying to traffic moonshine and everything. Mm -hmm. So whenever the government was just like, okay, we won't bother you anymore, a lot of people didn't trust them. They decided they were going to continue the tradition outside of the eye of the law. Uh, And then that was just a passed down practice for generations and generations to come. Um, Uh So a lot of people do it as a testament to self-reliance and anti-gov stuff. You uh, like your... You're into the the conspiracies and everything. Did you ever read about like uh, how the Kennedy family like became influential and elite by by bootlegging during Prohibition? I've heard about that. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's so interesting. Um, so a bunch of people did. Uh, the like everyone who started the big cities out west, like Las Vegas and stuff. That's how they got their start. Um, was interesting. I went on a vacation to Bar Harbor, Maine, which. Was, What's that sound? What is that sound? Oh my God, Taylor! Whoa! 
Your mic just exploded, bro. My mic is. Oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that. Now, I don't know yeah. why like a blown out audio is so funny to me. It's just Mimi as fuck. Hey, hang on, we gotta... yeah. Hang on, let me see if I still hear the thing now that he's muted. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Just unplug it Bro. and replug it back in. It's uh, you should always thought... podcast like that. Your your, your gain got maxed out. Is what? Yeah, happened. your gain was bad. It was clipping, dude. I don't That's think. Fine. Bro, was did you anybody. hear that? I thought that was the rapture, my <laughs> dude. Thomas, <laughs> uh, am I still blown out? Nah, sounds right normal. there. Perfect. Oh. Perfect. Yeah. No, th- that's weird. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Sorry, no, you're sorry good. about that. Okay, that's good. Yeah, that was interesting. Anyway. Um, I thought a train was about to hit your. Closer. It's so frustrating because it's like, what do I do? I haven't touched anything all day. All night. As soon <laughs> as soon as Taylor mentioned the Kennedys, a ship descended on his house. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it anyway. descended on the Hilton and said. <laughs> 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 um, I went to Bar Harbor, Maine, which is like a ritzy place in Maine. That back uh, at the turn of the century into like World War II, a bunch of big, fancy, rich people stayed at. So Edison had a house there. Uh, the Fords had a house there and all that. They didn't realize until the 1970s why the, all the houses were located so close uh, when they started trying to renovate nearby and found all these underground tunnels. And it turned out bootleggers would come from Canada and they would go in these underground tunnels and these tunnels led to like the cellar of every mansion around Bar oh, Harbor. God. So all of these like rich, fancy people who didn't know each other, like Edison Ford and all that, um, shared all this underground bootlegging ring where they would all go during the summers and get hammered. Uh, so like people who did that and supplied for them quickly made their way up to the top and mm-hmm. people like the Kennedys. Yeah. It's wild. Like all of those wealthy, like established families. It's like, well, how did they make their money? Oh, well, uh, they exploited millions of people and tens of thousands (laughs) died because they hadn't invented child labor laws yet. And they were making kids like reach into fucking metal shard piles and like retrieve things like basically what apple has like little african kids doing now in mines (laughs) to get like the fucking manganese they need for chips or whatever (laughs) yeah pretty much but sounds good to me uh, i need my manganese yeah (laughs) by any means necessary so (laughs) 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 Ah, i ended on that note i love the the best shit i've ever heard